What's going on, Pokemon trainers? This is Trainer Connor, and I'm joined with Kubal98. Hello. So, we've reached to episode 8 here. Very exciting, but it's going to be a very tough challenge. We have a very tough challenge ahead of ourselves here. Yep. So, that means that every battle that we do is going to be twice as difficult as the other battles that we've had. If you haven't seen the other episode, I think it was episode 7, go check it out. I'll put it in the description of this video so you guys can watch it if you haven't seen it already. Okay, so we're going to be doing the super multi-battle here. A few changes to note here. We have our record standing at 23. That's great. So there are a few changes that I made with my particular team. I will go over it when we do so. So let's go ahead and connect first. Let me choose Pokemon that I'm going to be bringing to the match. Alright, so you see I have Garchomp. Garchomp is short scarf. He's going to be with us again. I'm going to be bringing Mega Gengar as well. Mega Gengar seems like a great option because we did a few test recordings and a few Pokemon had Giga Impact and we need a solution for that. Don't worry about the test results. They don't matter. It's just to make sure that we're doing things correctly and what to expect. And we should be good there. So, Kubo, what are you bringing to the table? episode 8. So I'm bringing the oh, nine tails back and nice. that has been reoccurring throughout. Yes indeed. Same with my second Pokemon which is the offensive Alakazam. So you're bringing the nine tails and offensive Alakazam. Pretty good deal. So we're gonna have a Mega Gengar and a Mega Alakazam on our roster. Heading into episode 8. That is actually really good stuff. So we're connecting right now. See what we can do with that. And while we're waiting, uh, episode 8 is going to be battles 24, 25, and 26. And then episode 9, 27, 28, 29, and 30, if we get that far. It's just the rundown. I'm going to probably. Make episode 9 later, because I want to focus on a few other things. So that's what I've decided to do for the channel. And also, I just want to talk about that. We're going to be doing a, a partner video, like a collaboration about Pokemon Sword and Shield as well. You excited for that? Because I think we're going to talk about it. Uh, yes. Yes, so we're going to talk about what we're expecting in the new Pokemon games. I'll also put the trailer down below as well, so that it's easier to handle. Alright guys, welcome back. We had to take care of a few things, but we're all connected now. So we were saying about Pokemon Sword and Shield. I'm actually excited for those games. And it's for the Switch as well, so if you guys don't have a Switch, I might as well, you might as well get one, you know? Alright, so we're going to start battle number 24. You don't know what we're going to be expecting, so... <laughs> hey, it's anybody's game, and I think we're going to do just fine with our new additions to the table here. Mega Gengar and the offensive Alakazam. So let's see what our opponent's bringing in this first fight. Right. Yes. Yeah, this looks good. This looks good. Bennett and Ferrothorn. Oi. All right, let's see. Nine Tails and Shark Bite, the Garchomp. They are here. This is going to be intense. Okay, so it looks like Ferrothorn can't really do anything because it's pretty slow. It has access to Gyro Ball, so where are you going to be getting? You know what you're going to be getting? Still pondering to see. Yeah. I think for right now, mm. I'm going to use a one of the non-effective moves just in case. Non-effective move to what? Or to which Pokemon? Um, it's, well, it's not going to affect any of the surrounding Pokemon. So, 
You do have the option to switch out if you want. But... Yes, I do have the option to switch out. Okay. But I will wait on that. Okay, so I'm gonna go for outrage here. I'm hoping I can hit the Bannet. If it hits Fanathorn, that's going to suck. But. Oh, so well. Okay, I just, so use Protect. That's fine. Yep, I just use Protect. Use so, yeah. Snatch here. And... Okay, so <laughs> Fanathorn hits so it's like <laughs> Protect. Too, so, um, let's see how this goes. Cool, we hit the Bannet. Which. Okay. Wow. KOs it. It's pretty frail, so. That's good. No surprise there. No surprise. Zoroark, alright. Oof. We don't need to worry about its illusions ability. Which is a good thing. Ooh. Super effective. Okay. Yeah, see. I know what I'm, which Pokemon I'm going against, but since you're doing Outrage, you have, we have no idea what's going to happen. Okay, so that yeah. happens. <laughs> it's randomly, so I apologize, but we'll handle the Farrakhorn and the other Pokemon in a moment here, so... That did no damage. Okay, it has access to Gyro Ball. That's why I, I thought went... this... Ah, oh, dang. I should have protected. Well, it's a 50% chance because he used it the other turn, right? So, that's fine. Um, let's go into your Alakazam. Offensive Alakazam. You should do something. You have a lot of options, so... I'm still locked down on Outrage. Can't really do anything about that. I'm sure it's Scarf, and I'm not confused yet. I might switch out later, but we'll see. So I just Mega Evolved, mm -hmm. but I'm not going to be attacking this turn. You protecting? Yes. Okay, this makes sense in the in the sense that... <laughs> the way I said that, though. It makes sense that you're going to get your speed. Um, the first turn, you get regular Alakazam speed, but when you went for Protect... You're not going to get access to Mega Alakazam speed. And that's not bad at all. So that's great. I am confused now. He's using Payback. Okay, that, <laughs> that is great. I like it so much. Okay, this is... I'm glad that I went into that protect. <laughs> yes, indeed. So at this point, you need to use an attack. I want you to attack it. I'm going to switch out of here. Go into my Gengar, who's making his debut in this series. It's a shiny Gengar, no less. Shadow Ball, perfect. Yep. That's a good idea. Second the only there. effective yeah. move against... Alright. Alright. Alright, Oh! Yeah, that's gonna hurt it a little bit. So I was saying that... Psychic wouldn't do that much damage anyway. So I'm going to go for the Mega Evolution. I can easily finish off Fair Farm, but it's the secondary Pokemon I'm worried about. But I should be faster than that. So. And I, I, still have, I still have Garchomp, but it's okay. What is going on here? What, what kind of berry is he holding? I saw the animation. What? Yeah, I'm a bit confused about that too. Did it say what it was doing? Mm. Berry? Oh, it was like. It's... Payback. Oh, I went first. Okay. Yeah. I did over half. Shadow Ball, which Shadow should ball. Yeah. KO it. Yeah. Easily enough. Okay, okay this so is fine. now it's a this two on one. one. Yeah. Suck. Okay. That's Ooh. fine. That's fine. Ooh, I... Yeah, I, I can see why yeah. this is going to so, be a, an interesting battle. Sure. So, which one should I go for? Uh, Sludge Wave or Dazzling Wave? I think Sludge Wave will do more damage despite that it's not super effective. Sludge Wave, I'm faster. Oh, and just to note here, Sludge Wave attacks oh, everyone. Oh. It attacks everyone, so I need to be cautious when using that move, but it has a Focus Sash? Really? Dang. Okay, well, we have Garchomp in the back, so we're good to go here. But since Man, you use. Th that move and and it's a good thing that none of my Pokemon were there because yeah as you say mm -hmm. it would have hit everyone yeah that's why you have protect so that's why uh, yeah uh, you know it's important to do it at the right time oh oh no it's easy to do her <laughs> yeah but it's going to survive this <laughs> hit for sure I yeah see I don't understand it but it's okay I am going to continue going for outrage True, it it's may okay. endure, but it's not mm -hmm. going to be able to do that for much longer. I yes. Just, just Thank God. Did, did right there. <laughs> I don't have time for the stall game. I'm sorry. But 
Anyways, so that's the first match. That took a while. Dang. That was a long fight, and these battles will be longer, just saying, but we'll make sure that we get it going. Alright, we are heading 25. But even though it's longer, yeah. it should be more fun. More fun. So, sit back and relax, everyone. It's going to be a doozy, that's for sure. Number 25, let's go. Uh, make sure we do things correctly so we don't screw anything up. <laughs> and I thought we were close, but thankfully we planned it ahead. Alright, let's see what our next two opponents are going to be using. Ooh. Alright, let's see. Okay. We got Salamence and Delphox. Okay. Okay. Talk about power. So, right. Salamence could either not Mega Evolve or Mega Evolve, so we probably sh should yeah. keep an eye on that because Mega Salamence is mm -hmm. pretty strong. What type is Delphox? Is it? It's a Fire Fairy type. Oh, okay. So I need to be care careful about that. I um, should know because I used so I used Delphox as my starter for yeah. when I went through the Kalos region. Okay, it doesn't make sense that I use Earthquake right now because you're going to be attacking, are you? Are you yes, attacking? I'm going okay. to be attacking. So I'm going to use the Rock Slide. I'm going to go for the Flinch Chance. I'm going to choice Scarf. Hit both of these guys. Perfect. Now let's see how much damage it does. Great. Yeah, that's pretty good. pretty decent. I go in for the blizzard. Okay, it doesn't affect Delphox anyway, so you're good. It doesn't Salamence. affect Delphox, but it takes out Salamence. As long as it takes out Salamence, you're fine. Because Salamence is pretty powerful. Fire Blast, that's going to KO you, but you have out the man. So yeah. Critical hit, wow. Critical hit, but now it's a three on three. Sure, I can take that at this point. I mean, would you rather take out... A Salamence, and then lose your nine tails. Yeah, honestly. Hmm. Ooh, so this, this is the okay. Yeah, I'm going. You should attack the out the Rotom. <laughs> I won't say out of but why would you? Gonna attack yourself. But I yeah. Guess, uh, yeah, Mega Alakazam. Dang. So Mega Alakazam and Mega Gengar on the same battlefield is asking for trouble. That's great. <laughs> It's asking for trouble for the opponent. <laughs> yeah, that's for sure. <laughs> yes. So we hit both of these guys again. Um, I'm going to hit the Gulfox. Yes. Doesn't re really do much for the Rotom, but that is to be expected. Yeah. Shadow Ball. Yeah. See how much this does. Does she do something? At yeah. least. Yeah. It flinched. Okay. Not even less than I thought. Infernape. Infernape. Okay. Well. This we is, oh. this is not this is not new. We know what yep, to expect. I I'm, I'm, sure. I'm going to attack the Infernape. So okay. I'm not using protect, so Alright, I'm gonna switch out of here. This is risky, but uh, I can also go back into Garchomp. So let's go ahead and do that. Again, this is risky, but it's a risk that I'm gonna be taking here. Shiny Gengar. He's in psychic. All right, so in front of him should be gone. This should go. Yep. There we go. Nice. All right, so now that leaves with just Rotom, I think. Mm-hmm. Will um, Wisp. Okay, on who? It's gonna be me. Thank God, because I didn't want my Garchomp burn. I'm sorry. <laughs> but we're good. All right, so Burns, Mega Gengar, um, Sludge Wave. I could easily take out Rotom this way. This should not KO you based off experience. Um, well, just in case, I'm going to use Protect. Okay. Just in case, because. <laughs> just in case, yeah. But you never safe, know. Sorry. But safe, sorry. Yeah. Even though I'm using the Mega form, it can go up and down. You never know. I like the fact that you use Protect, but it shows that. Looks like you attacked it. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that's ridiculous. Well, battle number twenty-five. That, good. that battle went a lot quicker. Yeah, it did. I'm not gonna complain about it. So we got four more. Mm. That's great. Number twenty-six, and then we're going to take a break for episode nine. Great. So we're making we're, great progress. We're, <laughs> we're on a roll right now. Yes, we are. We, we like to keep this momentum going. Oh, yes. We want to keep it going, because why we want to end it? Like, I don't want to end it now. And Not yes. getting this good. Yes. <laughs> for pizza. 
I love so it. <laughs> as it gets tougher, we have to think of much more better strategies than what we're doing right now. Yeah, I'm like really happy I made the change with Gengar and the Kangaskhan because Mega Gengar has a lot more potential. I Ooh. think I may, may have to switch up like a few things for mine as well. We'll, 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 make, we'll make those adjustments and we can move forward. Okay, so this is interesting. I could easily take out Charizard if I go for Rock Slide, but I wouldn't do much to Superior, but you have Nine Tails! So, yep. That means. Well, I think you should know what I mean. Oh, yeah, I do. <laughs> you don't have to ask. I know. Yeah, yeah. So let's see how this goes. So. Okay, it hurts the Charizard only, because. Why not, right? <laughs> I hope I flinch it. Superior doesn't get affected. Oh, mm, Blizzard. Blizzard uh, should take out the Charizard. Let's see if it takes. Oh, it I almost got takes out. It was a critical. Oh! 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 Okay, so two things happen. Oh! Two things happen on that turn. We take out Charizard. It was a critical hit, and we freeze out the Superior. What? <laughs> Bring it on home. Oh Bring man. Bring it on home. All right, we're having. We're ready to sell here. So, okay. So, who, which Pokemon are you going to go? I'm going for both. Because Rock Slide attacks both okay. Pokemon. I'm not going to complain about that either. <laughs> See how this goes. So, avoid oh, my. Oh, it's yeah. a good thing that I suggested to go and attack the superior just in yeah. case, like what happened, it didn't faint. So it was frozen. Yep. I don't know. And now, now it's gone. Way, either way, I mean, this is using sword beams. That's uh, fine. But oh. Sock again. Okay, you want revenge? <laughs> no, that's not gonna happen. <coughs> that's not gonna happen. My apologies. All right. Rock slide again. Let's see how this works. Okay. If it has surgery, I broke it. <laughs> Well, of course. Oh, what? Oh, man. Oh, crap. That's double the bad luck you have right there. Oh, oh, oh. okay. That did a lot of damage. Holy yes. So, bring on who? It's going to attack you. Oh, man. Double I still have one more Pokemon. That's a double whammy. I still have one more Pokemon to deal with them. That's good. That's why we have to. So, you don't have to worry about losing one. And it's also a good thing that you also have... Yeah. Our side again. So, I may evolve again, yay. Perfect. <laughs> we need all the power we can get. All the power we can get. Leaf Guard. Okay. Mark slide again, you actually hit these guys. Perfect. It's a good thing that I decided to go with the psychic against Swalk. Sock, yeah. Sock. There we go. Done with him. <laughs> oh! Another flinch. I'm having some good luck with that. So why should I stop? I don't know. I don't want to stop it. Let's keep going. So I'm going to protect just in case something happens. So... Really? Okay, so I get all the flinches, but sometimes I get the misses as well. And you're using synthesis. Wonderful. I kind of thought our would KO it anyway, so... Yeah. And... It's, I, a, it's a 50-50. It, yeah, it's know. a 50-50, so you, you never know. Yeah. So. Okay, so let's see how this... HP goes, goes down a bit. Doesn't and then... Gleam, and doesn't gleam, does... Uh, Good amount. Okay, synthesis again. No, it didn't. Oh. It was a solar beam. It looks like it was using synthesis, but no. Mm. Thank God it can use that move again. <laughs> All right. Well, here we go. We are, I think, is that the last Pokemon? I think yes. it is. All right. <laughs> All right, guys. So we just finished episode eight. Thank you guys for watching this video and make sure you like and subscribe. Check out our YouTube channels and we'll see you for episode 9. That was fun. <laughs> You're telling me. Alright guys, take care.